What's up guys, so as you can see we're at Heathrow Airport and we're on our way to LA for a Gymshark event that I'm so excited to share with you guys. I think it's about an 11 hour flight so it's going to be a long one. The other people who are coming on this trip have gone on the previous flight so I'm on my own for this time but I'm just so excited to go anyways. I've been wanting to go to America for a minute now but even better to go on a Gymshark event so yeah going to be going there, going to be meeting a bunch of other influencers there as well. There's a bunch of big names coming down so yeah, make sure you guys stay tuned for this video. See you in a bit. Yo guys, so we are on the flight now. Gymshark did come through with the Premium Plus so the leg room in this flight should be good. Um, we're going to take off soon hopefully and uh, I'll catch you guys when we get to LA so yeah, I'm excited. Let's go. Yo guys, so we made it to the hotel. Time to check in, make sure everything's good. Bro, it just feels, feels sick to be here, man. It feels sick to be here, let's go. What's up guys, so quickly, as many of you might know, I recently launched my app, and in doing so, I took my training programs off of the website. But, I'm going to be putting my training plans back on the website for a limited time and on my website you'll be able to find plans that will suit you for whatever goal that you have. So, training plans back on my website nathanielmessiah.com and on top of that, since they're back, use code BACK for 50% off any of the training programs. So, training plans back, go to the website, let's get back to the video. Very steady, very, very steady. Yo guys, so now that I'm in my hotel room, right? I just wanted to come on in and say something quickly. So if you guys can imagine, like think back to like 14 year old Nathaniel and just in terms of the people he looked up to and what he wanted to do. Like I remember being younger and watching like David Laid videos of when he would go to like Gymshark meetups, pop-ups in like LA, all over the world and like that is what I wanted to do and that was a dream of mine. It wasn't even something that I necessarily felt was could be a reality for me, especially as I didn't see people like me doing those type of things. But through the process of, you know, my work, but then more so than that, you guys' support, because I was, I was working for time, but it's only when you guys started really supporting me that things started to pop off. So I've got to say an enormous thank you to you guys for putting me in this position, because literally at like 19 years old now, I'm literally doing what I dreamed of doing and I have you guys to thank for that because when it comes down to social media again yeah cool I put in the work but if no one notices it then it doesn't turn into anything so it's all down to you guys supporting constantly throughout the years you know this is over five years of me doing YouTube man I've just got to say an enormous thank you but yeah man enough of the soppy stuff man we're out in LA bro we're in LA bro what are you telling me hey right, listen let's get active it's got like the flag I'm trying to get <laughs> what are you saying, Ryan? What are we doing today? I'm stressing, mate. It's stressing. Nine o'clock morning. We're stressing already. Yeah, you've had a bit of a rough morning. <laughs> let's Just not talk about. Let's it. not let's talk not about talk it. About well, what are we doing cool. now? What's next? We are off to Venice Beach, famous Venice Beach. We're going to be hitting a bit of a photo shoot, aren't we? Blue yep. steels. Good. Me, you, David. David is not here though. <laughs> yeah, where is David? <laughs> I don't know where every, he is, man. Every gym shark event, David's nowhere to be seen. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna go down and do the shoot down at yeah. Venice Beach. This is like my first proper time in LA, so I'm so excited, ready to get down there, and yeah, let's go. Hello, mate. Hey, good. You good? Hey, yeah. so? hey, good. Thanks. Good. How are you doing? Hey, you alright? The gym's going to be open for people to come in and train. And We're shaping up, I can see yeah, it. Yeah, Lego renovated last year. Do you know what? I think I'm turning into a dad because the first first thing I thought when I saw this was, how did they get planning permission for that? <laughs> how did you get that? I was like, We're in the middle of LA. How did you get permission for this? This is crazy. Hey, buddies. Mr. How you doing? How are we? You good? Long time no What time do you get here? I got Hello, ask. wait, what? How have I never met this guy before? This guy's got a strong grip, man. How are you doing? I'm good, how are you? I'm, I'm doing great, The man. reason why we've never met is because you're halfway across the country. It's only there. about 11,000 miles, nothing major. What, are you out of the same hotel as me? Um, yes. I didn't check in there last night, but I will be there, yeah. Same one. Because I called this guy this morning straight to answer for him. I'm like, bro, we're not friends no more. What happened? You called me this morning? <laughs> I called you this morning. You actually? I don't even get that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, explain oh what we're actually talking about. So, the athlete manager for this event, he booked a hotel for every athlete to stay at this one place, right? Yep, me, right, him. Speaking to a few people really that slept located. there last night, Including apparently myself. it's extremely haunted. No, 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 no. Speaking bro, it's fine. Like, you didn't speak to me. I slept there. It was calm. The people that stayed there was fine, yeah. Who told you it was haunted? 
fucking six Brian. Six of us stayed there. Educated? None of us had any other uh, any negative experiences whatsoever. This guy had demonic dreams. Before I even checked in, someone was already in my room. Yeah, down side of the hotel. My bed, there was no someone was in my bed. Room. Someone used my shower. It's a hotel, mate. That's what happens. Like, no, the weird. person had vampire fangs and horns above their head too. Bro, they didn't. They know who it was. They still can't confirm it. And I talked to like five of the staff members. They all confirmed that. <laughs> and my friends yeah, Demar, but we, here, here's the biggest clue. Here's the biggest clue. I only have one address of a hotel in my phone anywhere, right? Only one address. The only hotel I've booked in a very, very long time. I copied that address last night to get my Uber driver to take me there. I plug in that address. I fucking show up. I go to the hotel. Turns up at the wrong fucking hotel. How on earth could I have showed up to the wrong hotel? It's my spirit guide spirit guiding guide me to a safe place to avoid <laughs> the demonic demons in the hill. Or it's trying to get you to learn up. how to overcome things and just go. You slept there last night. You slept there last night. I think that you've been possessed and now the, de the demons are working through you to influence me to join the dark. I'm out here at my Sheridan Hotel. So I hear you're going to be getting me pretty today. I am. You are. Oh, are we on camera? Yeah, we are. You are on the vlog. So I don't really. What, what were you yeah. doing with it? What do you think I need? What do I need? I mean, the whole nine yards. <laughs> <laughs> I thought she was going to be like, no, you don't need anything. You're perfect. No, he's perfect. Uh, <laughs> Alright guys, we're about to start our photo shoot. I need to get a pump man, these guys are gonna show me up. Just get some fake sweat, fake lotion going on. Warm weather. That's good. You got some cold. Whoa! Whoa! Let's not tear any more labrums. I'm just trying to do any exercise, man. Go, 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 do it, do it. What's wrong? I don't wanna be right. If being right means being without you, I'd rather live alone. How's the shoot going so far, David? It's going. It's going. I would tweak a few little things. They were, they was, was having a, 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 a argument with the costume lady. He was like, he wanted his stuff like this. She was trying to, no nipples involved. She was like, nah, cover that all up. She wasn't no, trying to hear not, it. It's not even about the nipples. It's about the, the littlest subtleties make a massive world of a difference. Just the slight positioning, the fabrics, body, this, that. It's all a cohesive thing. All those little details get missed. So what you're saying trying is to bang out you pictures, think but. you should be directing this. Is what you're trying to say. Yes. What's up guys, it's your boy Nathaniel Messiah and today is a very big day. It's the day of Gymshark's 10 year anniversary event down at Muscle Beach in Venice. Venice? Yes. Venice. Yeah, so... <laughs> okay, sorry, my... <laughs> <laughs> 
But yeah, so it's gonna be a really big day today. We've got a lot of people coming down. All the boys are here. I'm looking forward to it. Hopefully gonna do a very big deadlift. I don't know what I'm gonna lift yet, but we're gonna do something. Three forty. I never said no three. You're gonna do three forty, right? Pounds. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Matt's coming off an Achilles tear, but it's still very strong actually. But yeah, we're almost there. I'm gonna see you guys in a bit. <laughs> Yo guys, so we are with the one and only legend, Kai Green, he's in the building. Ain't no legend up in here. <laughs> nah, he's a legend. Bro. We just work at it. We trying to get things done. Let's we go, back bro. here Let's go. making it happen. Where we're we at? at, where we at? Well, you know where we at. We're actually at the uh, presidential <laughs> office. Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm well, kidding. Yeah, no, it's, it's the wrong spot. We're gonna go out in a bit, but yeah, we're just chilling right now. Obviously, sick meeting this guy. I've known obviously about you like pretty much my whole body the oh, whole time I've been lifting so you know it's, it's the Gymshark thing it's yeah, the reason yeah, yeah, why yeah. we're here of course Gymshark is doing the big major major takeover going on right Let's now go, they man. got muscle beaches on lockdown tons of people right outside, now tons because, of people outside I mean, you see how many people are yeah it's crazy bro a lot of people yeah. online it's crazy man a lot of people are trying to get the feeling <laughs> but I got the feeling of the flavor for some Gymshark right now I'm feeling good about that let's go bro let's real go real talk real but talk yeah, man. That, sick meeting you bro before you try to call me an old man on camera what I never said that. I mean, man. I damn. Said, if I know that you are your age, I'll be doing something. Whoa, like that. my age! <laughs> damn! Dude, I ain't nothing but 32 years old for the next 18 years. I swear, that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. Sticking to it. All right, cool. I'm sticking to it. <laughs> ben. Yeah. Are you lifting today? Oh, I don't know if I am. Bro, yeah. I don't think you should because you'll blow all the rest of us out the yeah, water. And it's a bit embarrassing. Yeah, you know that, right? Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's like, so I'll, I'll leave it to you. It's a business yeah. move. You don't yeah. want to like undermine your own actions. Exactly. Exactly. That was, yeah, yeah, yeah. Makes sense. It should be a good day. It should be a very good day. Now. I think yeah. Matt's out there listening now. Matt's out there in a second. The crowd's um, coming in. It's looking good. It's yeah. looking good. Looking forward to it. Let's go, man. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Tip for him. We're in um, Hilton Checkers, but they booked it's that for the, him. In the entire United States, it's ranked number seven in most haunted hotels. I slept Literally, like a baby, we, bro. There was no problem. There. Like, one person what? had, like, terrible... Yes. No, no, see, I wouldn't stay there. I did not say that. Bro, I slept like Literally, a baby. The anecdotal reports... Yeah. Because, and this is, this is the issue, right? So, this is literally a risk-reward scenario. So, yeah. you've got nothing to gain, but everything to lose by staying in a No, you could have sort you know of I mean? I breath. If you're under a logical perspective, here. you have everything to lose and nothing to gain. Okay, but it was you guys who booked this hotel. So... Uh, maybe they want you to get haunted. <laughs> yeah, and I am not looking for that at all. <laughs> is it Hilton? Is it in like an old building or something? It's not even that old. Hypothetically, if I did, if I were to become possessed from this hotel, and then I could no longer perform my Gymshark duties, would that be on me or on you? Well, Gymshark is going to be doing a future collab with the uh, church and the Pope, <laughs> so you get free exorcisms on the house. So it's like an insurance policy. Yeah, that's how we do it. Yeah. Are we just claiming entire insurance on it? Yo, guys, so I'm about to start my deadlift warm ups. I'm going to be deadlifting over there in front of the crowd in maybe 30 minutes. So start warming up. Hopefully, we're going to get 320 kilos. I'll start warming up, see how it feels, and then we'll get it going. So let's go. Oh, oh, oh. 
So like, as I pull it up, the hand went, and I'm trying to keep going, it just wasn't, it wasn't. <laughs> Yo guys, so as you saw, we just got done with deadlifts and things didn't go to plan. I got 310 kilos easily, but then when I went to 322.5, that was a PR attempt. And I really think I would have got the lift, but on the 310 kilos, I ripped a callus. But I thought, you know what, let me live through it. It's not every day we're on Venice Beach and yeah, doing all this stuff. So I thought, you know what, let's keep going. Went to 322.5 kilos and the callus like completely ripped on like two of my fingers. One of them really bad, the other one quite bad. So as I'm pulling, I'm feeling it ripping, 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 ripping. So I just couldn't get it to the top because my hand wasn't agreeing with me. So dropped it and the callus is pretty much all gone now. Wrapped it up, um, got it wrapped up and I don't know if we're going to be able to compete next week. We'll see but, um, that situation but regardless we're going to have a good rest of the day and it was fun regardless. So, yeah. Yo guys, so thank you for watching this video. A lot of you might be wondering why I didn't do my powerlifting competition um, because obviously I said for weeks I was going to do a competition and obviously it never ended up happening. This is why. Because a week out from my competition, I tore not one, two of my calluses on my hand while deadlifting. And after that, I can't really deadlift until my hand is healed. So it's about a week later and my hand is healing up nicely, but I had to miss my meat. But regardless guys, I had such a good time in LA. I've got more videos from LA coming soon, but this is just such a big monumental video of like all we got up to with Gymshark. And um, yeah, I'm so grateful for the opportunity and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, but anyways guys, that is why I didn't compete, but I'm gonna be real, it was worth it. It was worth it, I don't regret it. Everything happens for a reason. Maybe something would happen at my competition, who knows? But yeah guys, that is that. Thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna catch you guys 